Okay, back at uh, Massey, Ontario map. We're over at uh, Bill's Field 4. And we're going to try this. I call it a honey wagon, but it's a liquid fertilizer spreader. We'll get in here. It actually looks quite big for uh, this map, but I'm not going to complain. It's one of the items that came free when I opened the map. And it does appear that this eats up the liquid fertilizer pretty quickly. You may have to come back and finish with commercial fertilizer. I'm understanding why it's such a big tank now. Yeah, I'm not sure we're going to have enough to uh, finish Bill's field with uh, liquid fertilizer, liquid manure. Yeah, I think that's going to be about it. Wow, okay. I guess you would need that big a tank if you're going to do any kind of decent sized field with liquid fertilizer. We'll go back to the farm, park this, and pick up our other fertilizer spreader, finish this out. You must need quite a few cattle to you know maintain your supply of liquid manure. a little bit of a surprise to me really I don't use the liquid manure that much we'll park this in the yard here real quick grab the our regular fertilizing machine If I can back correctly here, I think we're going to need more on this one too. This one we just buy uh, fertilizer from the store. And we'll drive up the side of the field again. I really want to finish this field in this episode, get it growing. And we'll come do it down, do a little bit of uh, straw collecting. See what else we have time for. We've got some equipment to put away and some forage harvest to do. I guess I better wait for the car. Some city folk don't always stop. Or like to stop for tractors and such. That left turn's very popular. Never see a car coming down into town here.
Okay. We'll start on the far end of the field and see if we can meet in the middle here. I do need my little help screen there on the left. Don't see too many trains coming out of that tunnel either. Oof, I'm looking out through this. I really made a mess of fertilizing. bit over here I missed. Oh, I'm still missing it. Maybe I need to slow down and think about what I'm doing. last bit. Wow, okay. Not my best for a Lysen job, but uh, it's okay I guess. We'll speed up the time a little bit too since we've got everything planted and fertilized. Alright, back to some straw collecting. Now we really shouldn't need straw for animals or making mixed ration. So we'll probably just sell everything we're collecting here. It'll be more money. We can afford some new fields, maybe. We may well have to get uh, another tractor and some implements being as we're, we're getting more farming commitments here some of these extra fields oh my terrible backing again oh, maybe the third time's the charm that was kinda ugly too Let's see what we're going to get out of uh, our straw pile there. And it's going to be $3,300, which is not bad. That seems to be going so well, I might go up and try to collect another wagon load. So we have to either clear it out of the field or cultivate it in before we plant again here in this field.
Now, I did get a question. Uh, how do I pick the mods I use? Or I guess, how do I find the mods I use on some of these maps? Mostly, I, I know a lot of this equipment exists in real life. And I, I just go into Google and search for things by name. Like uh, the Big Bud 747 we're going to use in the Nebraska land map. Just went in and searched uh, Farming Simulator 2015 Big Bud 747 and pretty quickly found uh, one. If I've got the time, sometimes I just go into one of the popular mod sites and browse around and see what they have. That's generally how I find the, the barns and things that uh, I place in the, the game. And I think we're going to go and check and see how Bill's doing, plowing that new field, 19. It's always kind of a time-consuming job with the small plows we have. just about half done. It does look like a very nice house up there. We got other things to do, so we'll get to it. finish our silage harvest here? Maybe. Let's see if I can do some of this in cab. People do ask for some in-cab footage sometimes. I would like to use some different forage harvesters in the future. Uh, the one from the, the base game, the Crone, is pretty commonly used. I'd like to use a class Jaguar sometime. I don't see it terribly often. I got a bad feeling I've gotten off track here a little bit. This New Holland's probably not a lot different in function than the Chrome Big X, but uh, I, I like using it a little bit better. See our little screen at the bottom right says it's uh, by Modschun, German modder. Yeah, I've gotten badly off track here. Yeah, I think Modshoon's the 
the more popular New Holland 9090 mod that you find. Give this a good empty, give us a chance to go down to the BGA and see how full the silage bunkers are. I think sometime I would like to get the the other heads for this combine. And either try a whole crop or Collecting up the straw as chaff instead of selling the straw all the time. Up and we're done there. We didn't get too far off. Get the big uh, T8. Go dump that. And I don't think I connect disconnected the forage harvester when I got out of it. Nope, sure did. I do need the help screen for this. I've got several attachments there connected. I don't want to start making a mess of it. Just connecting everything until I find the trailer. We have to make the risky trip over the the river over here. Do that in, in cab. I'm kind of curious to see how that's going to go. Of course, speaking of mods, this uh, this New Holland T8s from the big New Holland pack it doesn't just have the base models; it's got uh, all the sub models. And you can customize them with fenders and things like that. Okay, here we go. Oh, that didn't go well. I might have to go out of cab to see if we didn't lose the trailer on that. Nope, that went well. Could have gone better. It probably would have been a wheel if uh, this had been the real world. Probably shouldn't have taken that shortcut over that feller's lawn. I didn't think of it at the time. Let's see what we have in the forage here. Two hundred thirty-five thousand, thirty-nine percent full. Yep, that will be a good amount. One more check to see how Bill's doing. I think we're going to call it a video. Well, he's still at it. It'll probably be done by the next time we get on here.
Well, we'll see you all next time.